You know, on the Wainai Coast, we don't deny our reality. And we understand that in some of our communities, unfortunately, we have the highest poverty in the state. But we kind of look at it as just our life's path and something that our community has to overcome. But within our community, we have so many heroes, like those that are here today, that have given so much hope to our kids who only see darkness, whose families just try to survive every day. But they give hope and light where sometimes you think that there's no tomorrow. So I am honored to introduce to you the leaders of the Nanakuli Boys and Girls Club, NFL Youth and Educational Town or Yet Center. Please raise your hands as I call your names. Clubhouse Director Claudia Lala Fernandez. Program Director Kekoa Tupua. All across the nation, millions of kids leave school with no place to go. Often left alone, unsupervised, and vulnerable to negative influences from others. How a child spends his time after school year-round can have negative influences on their future or positive ones. For over 150 years, the Boys and Girls Club of America, with its affiliated local state clubs, have been helping kids reach their full potential across the nation. Famous alumni include Fortune 500 CEOs, a retired forced out general, professional athletes, A-list Hollywood celebrities, and more. In Hawaii, there are seven boys and girls clubhouse locations here, three of which are located in my district, Waianae, Nanakuli, and Ewa Beach. Prior to 2009, the Nanakuli Boys and Girls Club was the only one without a clubhouse location, but not having a home didn't deter their former clubhouse director, Michael Kahikina, and then program director, Lala, and her assistant, Kikoa, from helping their kids because they were once there too. Both Lala and Kikoa and the entire Nanakuli Boys and Girls Club staff are all former clubhouse members as youngsters. Their lives were also forever changed for the better, and this was their way of helping others, especially helping troubled youth get back on track to become positive citizens. They credit their success by the consistency that their programs can provide, which touches upon their whole well-being, including social, mental, emotional, and spiritual aspects, with more, which more often than not is devoid in their family lives. There are numerous heart-tugging examples of the positive impact their leadership has had on the kids and their families. As one of our kids' relatives told us when they picked up their 10-year-old nephew, they said to them, you know, I don't know what you did to him, but for the first time, he's finally talking to us. So whatever you're doing, keep doing it. Just recently, one of their very own clubhouse members would name Youth of the Year and went on to represent Hawaii at the Boys and Girls Club of America's Youth of the Year Nationals. And this is just a tiny example of what passion is all about on the Waianae Coast. And that passion was rewarded when the NFL awarded the club with a $3 million facility as a gift to Hawaii for hosting the Pro Bowl for the last 33 years. When they got the call from the NFL, who picked them over many other clubhouses around town. They thought it was a joke at first. From not having a, lo a, lo a location, excuse me, from not having a location to a $3 million clubhouse was like winning the lottery on the Wai Coast. After completion in 2009, the Nanakuli Boys and Girls Club NFL Yet Center opened its doors to serve youth ages 7 to 12 where they can finally call their facility home and live happily ever after. Therefore, the council and the city, count, city and county of Honolulu takes great pride in recognizing the Nanakuli Boys and Girls Club NFL Yet Center for exemplifying dedication and commitment to serving the community with after-school summer programs for the Leeward Keiki with outcome-driven programs designed to increase their performance in the areas of education, health, and character and development. The council further extends its best wishes to our heroes on the Waianae Coast, 
Clubhouse Director Claudia Lala Fernandez and Program Director Kekua Tupua, as well as their staff for their continued success in all of their future endeavors. Mahalo. Thank you.